Welcome back, this is Bella Scoop with an episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. I'm joined, as always, by my trusty squad of Vash, Kyra, and Luke. Now, I got a little bit of uh, stuff to do here before we take on, uh, well, Lavos, uh, as, as that was pretty obvious that we were going to be doing uh, when we last left off. Uh, so I warped on out of there, took, you know, the, the portal takes you to the end of time, went through there, and now I'm back at the hero's grave because I actually forgot a tab here. And uh, didn't even notice it until Novin pointed it out to me, so thank you for that, Novin. But uh, I haven't had a chance to come back and get it for, for some time, so let us go in here. And up here by the grave, it's right there. I was, I was too emotional about Cyrus to spot it. So that's one item down. We actually have two more that we need to find. I'll meet you where the next one is. The next item that we are looking for is here in the Laruba Ruins. You can't do this until you actually get the the, the epoch and it is upgraded so that it can fly around the map. Uh, but this wasn't high on my priority list so I waited until now to get it. Uh, this is an item well, we've got a few like them before, but it's not something that is vital to the main quest, if, if I put it that way. Let's go over here. There's only one person here. It's a new. Who disturbs my slumber? New. Just trying to get some shut eye. I'll change Vash's name, so let me get some rest. New. Now, I believe that he actually changes uh, the name of whoever is in the front of your party. Uh, whoever. So, so if you want to change somebody's name, that's how you can do it. I'm going to keep it as is, of course. But, after that, he tells us to sleep well. Oh, he for I, capital F, forget for whatever reason. No need for the stone, so I give it to you. And we get the silver rock, which is another one of the triple tech uh, items. So, we can you know, use the triple text, uh, that will be done, like I said, in a bonus video after, after the main quest, because it feels kind of weird to do a, to do a full, uh, side quest video right now, even though I might be doing that, uh, because I need to find one more item, actually, so let us, well, I'll meet you there. And the last item that I need is going to be here in 600 AD, Bloon is over there, in the fields, all that kind of stuff. We need to head into the Denodora Mountains. Now for this one, I'm going to show you how to get there from the entrance. You need the powered up Masamune in order to do this, and you need Novin in the front of your party. So I'm going to well, walk you through these, taking out these very, very simple enemies now that I'm so over leveled for them. Like I said, very, very simple, but it is going to be a little bit of a journey here if I remember correctly, in order to get this one. This was kind of, this is, to me is, is a very obscure item, an obscure way to get an item, I should say. Gotta take these guys on, though, definitely. Even with their buggy defense, it just takes two hits, so. I mean, really, overpowered for this. Seems like such a random location for me to go to get one of the items that I need. Actually, wasn't there a chest that I missed in the Denodora Mountains? <laughs> that will be the one chest that I go back and get, apparently. I think that was the only one that I missed in this entire game, to be honest with you, but I, I, I don't know for sure. Uh, we are... that is not the way. <laughs> that is not the way! So I, I do want to show you how to get there from the entrance, I just don't want to show you... Hey, I'm in a random screen in, in the Denodora Mountains! And here it is. No, 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 I'll take you to the screen. Especially considering how quickly and easily it is for me to heal these days. I have no problem with it. Okay, I don't need to go that way, I don't believe. I think that's just... A way to get treasure. Is this the screen? This is the screen! Do you see what he's throwing? It looks a little different. There we go! Caught it! I await the freelancer! Starts glowing in Novin's hand! You got the gold rock! A changed frog art eye. What? A changed frog art eye? So yeah, you have to let him hitch hit Novin, who's in the lead, after you've got the powered up Masamune, and then he'll catch it, and it becomes the gold rock. I, I don't fully understand, but now I want that treasure chest that I missed, so I'm gonna head that way. I don't 
think it's much further than where I am, to be honest with you. I think it was just on the other side of this. It was next to a save point, I remember that. But I want to get it. I want to get everything in the game. You know what? I'm just... Yeah, I'll... No, I'll, I'll keep it in. It shouldn't take too long at all. But once again, that rock that I got here, the, the, the real reason that I came here. Uh, you have to get that if you want to get all the techs. Once again, another triple tech item for, for when Vash is not in your party. But we need to keep going. Well, we don't need to, but I want to. I want that item. Damn you guys. You would think at the level that I'm at, they would just run. They would just realize that I am too good for them and run. See, now here's the save point. I believe it is either this screen or the next screen where I missed the chest. I might have gone back and got it off screen. Uh, there. There it is. In there you can get a gold suit, which was great when when you could have gotten it. Not so much anymore. I'm going to have to fight these guys, aren't I? Yes, yes I am. So it's just a quick and easy trip out of here, if I remember correctly. Um, unless this guy's a douche and just wants to keep knocking me down. Forgot he did that, douche. Can I, can I go? No. Fine. Die. Ah, you brought friends. Get on my level! Just not even close. These guys are easy as hell, so... I think this was the, uh, the final room. Yeah, that was the final room. Ride the wind! Yes! Let us get out of here! But you guys forgot that's how you got out of here. I do enjoy that, though. But with all the items that we can get gotten, I guess you could say, I just have one more thing that I wanted to do. And that involves heading back into the epoch. I'll go ahead and keep this on screen just for, just for posterity's sake. We need to head back to the end of time. With everything possibly uh, that I can do in the game done, uh, except for, you know, the final boss and this one other thing. Full speed ahead, and no, I will disembark. Because it is time to take on Specchio in his final form. This is his final form. I believe I am a high enough level to take him on. Uh, but I am going to rearrange my party just a bit for this. Alright, so I've been doing some tinkering around. Tinkering. That's what, that's what I said. And this is going to be the party that I'm going to be taking in with me. I've got Bloon, Novin, and Kyra. So basically how my setup is going to be is I want as much magic damage as I can do uh, with Bloon healing. That's what, I, that's what I've aimed for here. So I do need as much speed on him as I can. That's why he's got the dash ring. And Novin, of course, is... Uh, well, everybody here needs some kind of... Uh, status protecting equipment, so... Well, he casts Confuse. I'll, I'll spoil it. Fine. He casts Confuse. Uh, don't let him Don't let him do that. So, I am uh, giving everybody something. He's, uh, he's got the safe helm and the Nova armor, the magic seal, so that he can do a little bit more magic and has additional magic defense. Uh, Kyra, I actually don't think I need the Silver Stud. This could come back to bite me in the ass. It really could. But I am going to go for the magic, uh, magic ring, I believe. Do we have anything else that will speed her up instead? Yeah, we have a speed belt. I guess I could put that on. Do I have anything else that's faster? No, okay. Just double checking, just double checking. I do want to get as many attacks in, and, uh, you know, as I've been tinkering around, Kyra has been my weak link here in terms of speed, not in terms of damage or anything like that. But with that all said, let's take on the monstrous form of Specchio. I am ready for you, sir. Hi! Looking for some practice? Could you have picked some better music for the ultimate fight here? Alright! Like, seriously, this is... This is like introduction to Chrono Trigger music that we got going here. And this guy is a dick. He gets a ton of turns, turns in. He's got some powerful abilities, including one that, well, 
it auto kills you like it, it there's no doubt about it like before he even really uses the the attack you can see it on on the, the HP is like oh he killed somebody you know just waiting for them to die go frog flare that is why I brought this party along let's take a look at that I don't really need to see all of bloom I'd rather see the frog Go Frog Flare! 1775. Honestly, not that much damage, but it's the best thing that I got, I believe. I could be wrong, though. I could be wrong. Uh, I was always told that this was the best setup for this, and I want to believe what I have been told from people that have played the game more often than me, but that's just me. Go Heal Beam! That is why we need Bloom as fast as possible, because we need him healing all the damn time. And by all the damn time, I do mean all the damn time. Because this guy hits like you wouldn't believe how often he gets a turn. Go another heal beam, go another frog flare, and hopefully with this setup I should be able to take him down. That is my goal here. Go frog flare! I don't know why there's such a delay in it turning red. Well, the frog, I should say. Oh, yeah, go ahead. Hit Kyra with that. See how well that works out for you. She's got the highest magic defense, I think, out of everybody in my party. It's between her and Lanya, I know that. So far, we're, we're not doing too badly here. Just need to, to wait for, for Kyra's turn sometimes. That's how things go. Even with the speed belt, she is still the slowest one here. And there, you can see it. it, it that killed Bloom. So, what I'm going to need to do here is use a revive, and then I'm going to need to use uh, uh, Let's go for a cure, too. Make sure that you do not die again. But I, I, I can't really guarantee that I can beat this guy. Uh, to be honest with you, I, I have tried several times, and I'm getting better, I'm getting better, but this guy is tough. And I usually don't beat him at this point, I'll put it that way. I don't beat him at this point. There's usually another point where I'll come back and beat him, but not right now. And I know some of you are very confused by what I just said, but all will be made clear eventually. Uh, but we need to keep going and... Uh, go, not Frog Squash. I made that mistake once. Frog Flare! Going for frog squash instead of frog flare, and it really did bite me in the ass in the long run. Hopefully, I oh 2502 damage, nice. Um, hopefully, what's with the glitch? Hopefully, I can take him out before he uses the insta kill ability again, uh, because I don't know. It seems to be on a set pattern here on how often he uses it. I can't. I haven't had time to count his attacks, but it definitely does seem to be a pattern. Yeah, go ahead and use Ice, too, I believe. Yes, Ice, too. I do not mind that one one bit. Now, we are getting close to the point where I thought, hey, you know, this is why I need uh, Kyra on, uh, on the gold stud, because, as you can see, she's only got one frog flare left in her before I'm going to have to switch her for something else. Something else. Or at least use some kind of... Uh, MP heal, but I don't want to do that if I don't have to. Come on, Frog Flare, for the victory! 1565, not enough for the victory. And he's going for lightning, too. He moves in the middle for that one. That is not a good sign for me, to be honest with you. But I'm going to risk it here. I'm going to risk it. Let's go for shock. I'm going to go for some powerful single attacks here in hopes that I can deal enough damage this turn that I can knock him out. 792, not enough for the victory. And he has killed Bloon. Why are you picking on Bloon? Oh, don't you do it. Don't you... Oh, that shouldn't be enough. That shouldn't be enough. Okay. Go full tonic. I believe I can 
by these. Ugh. Have to wait. There we go. On him. Yes, on him. I do mean on him. Fultonk only does 500. <laughs> I didn't realize that. Is that going to be enough to kill Novin? Ah, crap. No! No, he lives! He lives! We're going to go for a heal beam. No, definitely. And then we're also going to go for a... Uh, Jeez. I'm going to switch over to uh, to Novin starting to heal now. Because he definitely needs a little bit more heals than what we got right now. And then hopefully Kyra has some kind of attack here. Go Mega Bomb! Good thing I healed Novin twice. That's all I have to say about that one. That is the last of her MP. I don't want to have to use uh, like any kind of... MP heal right now, but if I have to, I have to. He's still not dead. Go. Yeah, go. Go heal. Even though I do believe that Novin does have the power, or Bloon has the more powerful attacks right now, but we're gonna keep trying for this. We're gonna keep trying. And I might be doing this the stupid way, but this is the way that I'm going to do it. Uh, frog Squash, probably not that effective right now. Let's go for Leap Slash. Go Leap Slash! It missed! Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, screw it. Full Ether. Hopefully I can just buy more of those. I think I can, to be honest with you. Alright. Another uh, Heal Beam all around. And then I think I got enough for at least one more frog, or er, yeah, frog flare, and then hopefully that's enough to take him down. Like I said, this is not an easy fight, especially when you're trying to save items for the actual boss. So, oh you, you dick! You've got to be kidding me! Oh come on! I was so close to it. I just. Uh, just healed her MP. Go another heal beam. Like I said, I think I got one more frog squash, or yeah, frog flare left in me, not a frog squash. Uh, God. This guy. This guy, man. This guy. We should be able to take him down, though. We should be able to. Alright, we need another... Oh, you... Dick. Is that going to be enough to kill Kyra off? It is, just barely, but it is enough. So I'm going for a leap slash, and I'm going for a shock here. And hopefully that... Why do you keep missing with the leap slash? That's that's like a low level tech. I'm, do I have to go for water too? That's, that shouldn't be that powerful. But another 794 damage. Still not enough for the victory here. He's got maybe two more attacks left in him. And hopefully I can get off enough attacks to finish the job here. I don't want to use any more items, damn it. Okay. Go for that. And this is my last chance here. Area bomb! Go area bomb! For 593 more damage! Which is enough for the victory! Down goes Specchio. No tech points awards, uh, awarded. And no experience awarded, so there's no point in, well, trying to revive everybody for that reason, I should say. Uh, that was most embarrassing! That was very damn close. Don't make a habit of this. Here, this is for you! And we get Specchio's Graceful Set. We get a Magic Tab, Speed Tab, Power Tab, and 10 Elixirs. That's the real reason that you do that, the 10 Elixirs. I am the Master of War. Whew. Sometimes I scare myself. But we have beaten the guy. Is everybody back to normal now? It'd be greatly appreciated. You are. Hooray. Now it is finally time to take on Lavos. But, before I do that, I do need to change my party to, you know, the one that I had originally... Yes, I need to change my party. 